What's up guys, this is my second account. All right, there's gonna be a lot of crafting that I need to do here. So I got over 200 million gold and I've been farming Golem 11 for so long on this account. And yeah, I mean, you see, I, I, got, I got ML Cecilia, I got ML Ravi. So can I make those two hero like really strong with some crazy craft, I hope some crazy craft. So in this video, it's going to be a hundred necklaces. Uh, I'll do uh, more videos like a hundred rings and a hundred crafts. Like it's going to be like 25 weapons, 25 helms, 25 chests and 25 boots. And uh, yeah, over 10,000 sky stones. So I can farm adventures like crazy. 55,000 dark steel. 55 over 55,000 over 200 million gold and over uh, 35,000 ancient coins so if I'm crafting jewelry I'll be able to enhance some hopefully nice pieces and uh, yeah we'll see what happens we'll see what happens all right let's get in there okay let's do it up boys Necklaces. I have a hundred slots in my inventory so I can just like craft non-stop. Here we go. Okay, I'm not not gonna worry about rare. It's about oops. It's about heroic with three substats that uh that are percentage or speed. I mean, it could be a mix of different. Oh, it could be a mix of different uh, stats. Now, it doesn't have to be all offensive or all defensive. I mean, if things don't go too well, you know, I'll just lock it. It's it's a pretty solid craft. It's just I'd like to avoid. Flat stats besides speed, of course. So with the amount of uh, dizzies, oh, I should have locked that one. The amount of dizzies and uh, just debuffs all around, I'm probably gonna have to just stack a ton of effect resistance, like a ton of, the, of it. I'm talking, I'm talking like over a hundred, 150 maybe, like with. Uh, like that's the problem like getting the right gear to do it is not easy because uh, it's gonna be HP or defense sets and uh, it's not a resist set so it's uh, much harder I'm gonna need strike gauntlet but I'll be trying different things I got Sigurd Sight as well I bought it from the uh, from the shop, so I'll be able to just test different things with her. I'm not far uh, farming Banshee, so I'm not gonna have a counter set. I feel like counter crit would be uh, best in slot for her. I mean, a counter would give her fighting spirit, and it would allow her to just well heal back. Like whenever she gets hit. She, she would heal uh, between, it's up to 8%. I have it written here, her multipliers, ML Ravi. Oh, unfortunate about the flat stat, but let's just lock it for now. Yeah, the passive is between 6 to 8% self HP, uh, oh, yeah, self max HP restored. And there's no limit, that's the cool thing. That means like uh, you could be hit by multiple enemies and you would just trigger it unless you didn't have the fighting spirit to, to trigger it. My god, Flat City. Flat City. So I'm gonna have to be very... I mean, I, I'm, I'm not gonna enhance any Necklace, it's gonna have to be like really solid. I just wish I can get a solid one. 
in those 100 crafts. You know, I mean, it needs to be at least heroic with three substats that I can use. And since, since I need the effect resistance, I mean, really, it could, it could be anything. Oh, that was... Close, but defense and HP, substats, mineral, min minimum rolls. That's, that's unfortunate there. I mean, with ML Ravi, you need to land a killing blow on skill 3 so you can actually revive a random ally, dead ally, with, uh, with uh, skill nullifier on, the, on it. So... I mean, if, if you don't kill, yeah, that, that's a huge part of her skill set that goes out the window right there. And her damage, of course, is nothing insane. Maybe she gets buffed later down the line. Well, hopefully, her damage gets increased, but that passive is very powerful. Of course, it's, it's, she's not about, like, she's not going to do as much damage as normal Ravi. But she, she does provide some pretty cool things. Like that, that passive, man. She can... Between the passive and... Oh. That ain't half bad. Between the passive and the leech on skill 1. That, that's a lot of sustain. And soul burn with skill 1 to increase the damage and the leech. That's cool. And I want to test her with Shimadra's staff on the team. So basically the, her leech is going to be even more. Uh, at plus 15, it's, it might be like 30% increase. And it works. Shimadra's staff will boost the healing of uh, lifesteal. Flat city... And that is a lot of gold. Like on my Europe account, I probably farmed over, like it's been 75 days, I think. And from all the sky stone that I've received since like, like all the freebies you get, all the, the, the promotion rewards in the arena for, uh, from hitting legend rank one, so many sky stones, over 30,000 in one month initially. After that, of, of course, it goes way down. But uh, since I'm in champion and I was in legend for a month, I've been getting a lot of sky stones. And like I'm at about at 250 million gold farm on the Europe account. But this this account, it's it's over seven months old, right? But I've been farming golem for a long time. Like I've been saving all uh, all this gold, all these materials. For this very moment now I was just waiting to get like some some exciting new heroes and uh, ML Cecilia is definitely it ML Wow that's unfortunate that means that I I'm gonna lock it still um, ML Ravi well I'll try her I'll, I'll, I'll try her as best as I can and I want to try her in, uh, in multiple areas of the game. It's just, she needs the gear. This account doesn't have like crazy gear. I mean, I do have some pretty decent gear right now on, on her and on Cecilia. I mean, I don't know about decent on, on both. Maybe one has better gear than the other, of course, but I definitely want some, some better gear. And I, I, I think that with with 200 million gold and all the uh, 55,000 dark steel and the 35,000 ancient coins, I feel like I can, I can craft some pretty solid items. Now the jewelry is gonna be easy. Jewelry I can just like enhance them from other ones that I craft and from all like the charms that I already have plus all the ancient coins that I have. Like it's not gonna be any issue to bring those to 15. The issue is really going to be the weapon, helm, chest, and boots. That will require some pretty heavy farming and adventure, but I'll be able to like 
If I can craft, craft some like solid pieces, uh, it shouldn't be an issue to bring them to plus 15. Well, nope. To be honest, probably halfway. No, I'm a bit more. Oh my god, almost done. Almost done, man. 100 necklaces. Just dropped down below 200 million gold. Okay, well, that's the wrong set, but yeah. Not quite. Maybe I should craft more. But it's just gonna be too much in one video. I, I want to do just uh, like some, some quick videos. I mean, crafting them is quick. Oh my god. It's when it comes down to enhancing. Okay. That's not bad. I mean, HP set with HP main stat. And then uh, three substats that can be used. The crit damage, of course. It's almost there. I'll lock it. So, I mean, I mean, this is better than a lot of pieces that I crafted so far. Ah. Oh! That's not bad at all. There we go. Defense set, but I don't care. I don't care. Look at that. That That's really solid. I can use all these stats. Of course, the effectiveness... Like, I'm gonna have to... Like, that's the thing, though. The effectiveness on uh, ML Ravi is, uh, is worthless. She doesn't need it. But there's ML Cecilia. And if I build a male Cecilia as a bruiser, well, she can definitely use all these uh, all these stats. But I mean, ML Cecilia, I would usually build her with even like a HP necklace to really get that barrier as high as possible. But if I want her to have some some solid damage, I, I would need a crit damage necklace though. So it's fine, and it it doesn't matter. Like it really depends on where. Okay, where it's gonna roll, where it's gonna land, because if it doesn't roll ever in effectiveness, I can use it on ML Cecilia. Okay, so that was the strongest piece, because most of the other stuff, it's been like, okay, there's that as well. Like, this could be used for uh, Cecilia, but I mean, it's it's not as good as I, I would have hoped. I mean, with that amount of gold and materials, I should have, like, a full set of epic gear. A full set of epic gear. So, let's uh, let's start off with this one. This is definitely the most exciting one. I'm not going to use my charms just yet, because I need to clear, uh, make some space. I already have some jewelry that is uh, that I need to get rid of as well. So, there's that. Be honest, this is not the worst, but have to be very strict with uh, what I'm gonna keep. I don't want to. Maybe it uh, does great success. Five eight six six. Ah, four effectiveness. The worst. The worst substat. I mean, Cecilia definitely needs the effectiveness, but my God, it was a four. Oh my God, effectiveness again. Are you kidding me? A six. Okay, let's just <laughs> let's just uh, roll it to plus nine and see what happens. Make some space real quick. Five, eight, six, sixteen. Okay, that was maximum roll on attack. So, I mean, it's not it's not bad, but to be honest, the best two would have been. Well, I mean, I can use the attack for ML Ravi and ML Cecilia too. It's just the HP would have been better, of course. 
Okay. That's not bad for now. I mean, there are so many crafting sessions that I've done and I can't get anything like close to what I just enhanced. So there's that. And where's the other one? Was that... It was. It was uh, an attack set, but wait, there it is. No. That's it. Okay. The struggle. Okay, just that. Five, seven, two. Okay, seven defense. Not bad. Let's see here. Twelve, seven, two. <clears throat> yeah, minimal, min minimum roll on crit damage. Nothing crazy. I'll probably just stop here. That I'm not gonna enhance. Mm, not good enough. I could try this one. You never know. You never know. Maybe it just dodges the flat HP. If the roll starts into it, though. Oh my God! Of course. Of course, it would roll into it. It's not bad. Depending where it rolls. Should start sacrificing uh, some rare. Five eight two. Max speed. Five eight six. Ah, two speed. Let's bring it to plus nine. Okay, starts to get start getting rid of the rare gear. I mean, yeah, I'm I'm just gonna get rid of all of it. Five eight eight. Oh, all right. Stopping here. That was a failure. I mean, this is this is not bad at all. This this could potentially be the best piece. Six six six. Ah. Oh. At least it's HP, but still, I can use all these substats. My god. 1066. Okay, max roll on crit damage. Let's keep on going here. 10613. Five crit damage. Definitely not bad. I guess we'll check what we get at plus twelve. All right. Man, that piece is so bad. Three rolls, right? And it could have started with that HP and that attack. So bad. Uh, but this gives too much experience. I need... Okay, I'm just gonna use some... Uh... Okay, like this one. That stole garbage. Let's attack. I mean, you can use the attack for a hero like Dizzy. But it needs to be damn amazing for that. Double flat is just easy. Besides speed, easy way to get rid of those. Where 
Do we have attack here? And here. Hmm, yeah. 10, 6, 18. One more. Okay, this one. Oh, okay. That's not bad. All right. So that one, right? That's solid compared to I mean, that one's not bad too. Defense set though, I need as much HP as possible though. But it does lose, lose value because it's defense and then the effectiveness I can't use on ML Ravi. ML Cecilia can use it though, but more HP would have been uh, much more useful. So this is an easy like one to calculate. I got 30 from attack and effectiveness, 38, so 43. Uh, percentage worth of stats all these substats they can uh, roll a maximum of eight initially and afterward so uh, yeah 43 points of stats there uh, this is almost the same crit damage is seven maximum now the value on that is uh, seems to be lower because it's not epic so there, there was a substat that needed to be rolled, so there's a, there's a loss there. So there's 28, 34, and 41. It's very close, but this one's plus 12 and the other one's plus 9. The, the difference is that this is on an HP set, so I get the extra value there. And this is the... Offensive power of that necklace is better if I need that crit chance because my crit and crit damage Then you got the attack plus the HP. That's those are all offensive uh, stats for uh, bruisers like uh, ML Ravi and ML Cecilia Okay, that, that's a solid piece. I'm, I'm just gonna bring it to plus 15 Let's just Do that how many I have 18 that I'm holding that is way too much. I need to uh, get rid of more of those. It's almost like I should get rid of all. Should get ri rid of everything. Like if I wanna make more uh, 100 craft videos, it's not good enough. Nah, it's, like if it has a flat substat, like what do you want me to do with that attack? Uh, substat there's a flat HP can't do anything with that got survival and we got like we got offensive stats too so that that's not good I mean there's always this flat substat to worry about some attack set I mean I could keep it but I could say that for so many pieces I have to be more strict and this is not gonna it's not good enough Offensive, defensive, offensive, defensive, even effect resistance on that one. Flat defense, no thanks. Yeah, okay, this, we've got the set and the main stat that matches. We got three substats that are for defense. This is definitely good. This one. Uh, the set doesn't match and we got two flats anyways in fact resistance doesn't work there so that's that's a goner this we got offensive effectiveness I mean doesn't work for all heroes that would need uh, a defense percentage main stat I need to go lock that other necklace before I just dump it by mistake Right? Where is it at? It's not locked. Yeah, that, that, that's not bad at all. It's definitely not bad. I don't know how it's gonna roll, but it doesn't have health percentage though. That's, that's the issue that I have with, 
uh, that I have with. But you have to balance your stats anyways. And maybe a piece like this, like you would use that on like a tanky hero and you wouldn't necessar necessarily need the speed substat there. So anyways, uh, that's, that's still a solid piece. Offense, double offensive substats. I don't like it at all. That's the thing, when you want offense, you have to, uh, I mean, you need crit chance, crit, crit damage on your, your main stat in most cases. I mean, that, that's usually how it goes. Now, how many spots do I have? I need to get rid of seven. Seven more, so let's start dumping some of these uh, necklaces with uh, some XP into them. That's definitely some crappy necklaces right there. I mean, this is 70. Like, that was really early on. I just, like, power those up. Maybe I needed to make space or something. But there's always, like, some pieces that you enhanced early on. You, you needed something, right, to, to just use on your heroes. And, uh, I mean, like, they did their job. How much XP? That's too much. Can I save that and just... Uh, What's that one? Nah. It's not bad. Okay, let's go with charms here. Not all at once. 10, 6, 18, 7. Yeah. Okay. 6 effect resistance. Could have been worse. Could have been 4. Could have been 4 attack. So it's definitely not bad. All right, so 10, uh, I mean 100 crafts and that's the best I got. I, I would say this is definitely not terrible, but it, the effectiveness, I mean, can't use that for Ravi. So it has to be for Cecilia and I don't, I don't like how it rolled for her. So yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm gonna do more. I'm gonna do 100 rings. And uh, like I, I can show you what I have right now on both heroes. I mean, let me just open ML Ravi here. Like, look, her weapon is not powered up to 15 yet. The chest as well. Uh, I'm scaling up S3 first. I mean, need to kill for the revive. And she definitely needs more uh, awakening. I just need two more. Two more of these and after that i mean i have those covered so a uh, bit more stats there and uh yeah hp and defense that's good now hp i mean i'm pretty comfortable with that amount the crit chance i can definitely use some more effect resistance is total garbage so i mean i'm just testing her with uh sigurd's side but i mean the dizzies in the meta, it's crazy. There's disease like here and there, like everywhere. They're everywhere. So I definitely need to switch things up. I don't know. Maybe I have to wear an effect uh, resistance ring, actually. So uh, that could be a solid craft. You know, that necklace for Bruiser uh, ML Cecilia, that is actually quite good. Like, speed right there is like... Uh, like that's two points. Let's say it, it rolled four twice. That's two points. Defense is, I mean, that's not even two. It's not two max rolls right there. But let's say it's almost four because there's one speed extra. Uh, crit chance, so that's five because that's one max roll. And uh, the crit damage is, so that brings it to like 6.5 out of a total of uh, eight. Because you have, let's say you, have, you roll perfectly, right? It's a heroic piece. You have three substats initially. They all max roll. So that counts for, th that's how I count my the value of an item. Like how good it rolled. So you got three substats. They, they, they are max roll. So that's three points. And then you can roll three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. 12, 15. Get uh, an extra roll. At plus 12, you get a new uh, substat. But anyways, max run, maximum would be like eight points. 
So let's say this one is a is a 6.5 out of 8, which is like really good, considering all these uh, these subsets are super solid for offensive power. So if I want to build ML Cecilia, uh, I prefer to have a health necklace. That's what I've been using on Europe, and it does boost her survival. And uh, I mean, she's more flexible that way. I could have Orius on her, or I could have Elbrus Ritual Sword, which I, I, I like both of them. And maybe I don't even need to run Orius on the team. That's the thing. So we'll see. Uh, right now, she's built as a tank. But uh, if I just show the gear right now, you know, th this is this is terrible. This This thing is terrible as well. This is this has a lot of value from what I know. That that's a lot of value actually. Crit damage is a bit more than three points. Health, let's say it's four, five, six, seven. That's se seven out of uh, that's seven out of nine, and there's still a roll to do. Actually, that's a really high value. The the unfortunate thing is it's a, a defense set. But still, uh, it's fine. I can mix and match, like use different sets, as long as I'm getting uh, survival. So uh, yeah, I'll showcase her later. It's just I need to do some crafting, and I definitely need to up that effect resistance because it's not gonna cut it against all the the rabies. Uh, sorry, the all the dizzies. Amel Cecilia, she <clears throat> she's tanky. Her defense is too low though. I'm running. I'm trying to run immunity, but this is. I mean, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. Two, three, four, five. Yeah, in term of value, it's pretty good. This thing is kind of trash, I think. Yeah. It's like barely a five out of... Uh, well, it still needs a roll, but... It's like barely five out of like nine out of eight, because I, I need to reach plus 15. And this, this is garbage. This is garbage. This is not so bad. This is not so bad. I can use all these substats. The attack is not optimal really, but it does boost the damage. This is, this is so trash. This is so bad. So there's a lot of room for improvement and I'll be crafting a lot more. So thanks for watching guys. I'm Astronox. Like, comment, and subscribe for more. Press the bell icon if you like to be notified whenever I release a new video and check out my other videos. They should be showing up on the screen now. Playlists of all sorts. Arena, Guild Wars, guys, tips and autos, and Abyss Floor 62 plus. So check those out if you haven't. So I still have yeah, over 50,000 dark steel. So 195 million gold. And uh, the ancient coins, I didn't touch them. So yeah, over 35,000. We are good, boys. We are good to craft some pretty solid pieces still. Also, join the Discord server. Uh, come chat with us. Have fun, guys. And uh, good luck with all you do in the game. Peace out for now.